We're out here in the streets of New York City. What's that smell? It's love. Today, we're going to talk about relationships in Marvel Comics. It's time to beat feet, because I'm the Marvel man on the street. It's a beautiful day in New York City, and there are plenty of beautiful relationships in the Marvel Comics universe. Could you please tell me what your favorite relationship is and why? Um, probably Gamora and Star-Lord. Yeah? Yeah. Why um, I think they kind of help each other grow and change, and they just have a really good relationship. I think it's a lot like our relationship. You know, she's more serious and a little goofy. Uh, Cyclops. Cyclops and Jean Grey. Cyclops and Jean Grey? Yeah, definitely Cyclops and Jean Grey. Which Marvel ship is your favorite and why? The one we've just created, a punk Hela and a punk Spider-Man. That's quite unlikely, but it's us. True, punk's got to stick together. And even though she's a villain and I'm a superhero, you know, sometimes music brings you together. I'm very impressed. I'm not sure it's canon, but I'm very impressed. I think it's the Black Widow and the Hulk. Yeah? Mm-hmm. Why? She seems to be as hot as nails, and yet she can tame the beast, so to speak. Well said, very poetic. It's gotta be between the Hulk and the Black Widow because they're so different and, you know, it just really seems hard for how that would really work. Yeah, do you think they would have to go to couples counseling? Oh yeah, definitely, he's got anger issues. I think they both have a little bit of anger issues, oh, yeah? yeah? Definitely do. yeah, yeah. There's, there's a little bit of repression on both sides, oh, yeah. but I'm not a psychologist. Neither am I. Uh, my favorite is obviously the Hulk and She-Hulk, Red She-Hulk, excuse me. Because even though they're both very, very angry, they still love each other through thick and thin. Especially thick. Especially very thick. <laughs> <laughs>